Welcome ladies and gentlemen and thank you for visiting the channel and today I'm going to share with you my on-feed experience with the Nike Air Force One Shadow. Alright, I'm pretty excited to show to you guys or to share with you this new Air Force One iterations. I think this is one of the best as there are a lot of good iterations of an Air Force One. And let's go on some details on this shoe. First up, it does boast a sort of a deconstructed look, sort of a waffle, Sakai or an off-whitish kind of design. Uh, starting one with the mud guard in the toe box as you can see you have two layers of mud guards one is the synthetic leather usually found on you know the your usual Air Force one but in this case it added a rippled layer of mud guard in the toe box right over there and even in the eye stay it's really like a deconstructed off whitish kind of design when you have two eye stays right over here and another layer up there now I don't know if you could notice it also have shadowy white swoosh beneath it if you can see right over here and not only that the, the swoosh itself uh, seems to have an unfinished look because the entire swoosh does not receive stitchings as you can see here it does have some loose part another deconstructed style and you have like an extra lacing system or a collar hanging as part of the deconstructed look obviously you also have an additional air rubber stamped on top of the usual air embossed lettering on the heel of the shoe and typically you have the same traction as an Air Force One has I think one of the things I really loved about the shoe is the midsole uh, usually you will have a firm thick rubber capsule in an Air Force One but in this case yep it's a foam midsole not only can you feel it on the sides but also on the bottom as well so this is a soft midsole and obviously when you have a foam midsole it kind of like smoothened the impact of every step and again because this is a foam it's lighter than an Air Force One really in fact it is more lighter than any rubber capsule shoe aside from Nike brands so I'm pretty excited about this shoe now other differences that you have in here you have the soft canvas tongue with a Nike logo one thing I think the shoe should have is the steel tagging right over here it's just plastic I don't know why they didn't put it a steel tag but anyway it's still a good shoe fun to walk in you have the Nike uh, brand on the heel of the shoe and you know you don't get wrong on a triple white Air Force One like this I think this is uh, for me one of the best Air Force One iteration again because of that off white look the deconstructed look but also that soft midsole I mean you can never go wrong so let's see how this looks on feet
that is my on feed experience of the Nike Air Force One Shadow. Now, if you want to see more videos like this, please don't forget to subscribe, and I'll see you all next time.